Welcome back to the LRK channel. Thank you for joining us. Today we have part one of a two-part video series coming out. Part one today, what you're watching is an unboxing of the D65 by KBD fans. And then part two, which I'll release in one week, will be the actual build video. But be sure to stick around to the end of today's video. I'm doing a giveaway and I'll be announcing the details of that giveaway at the end of the video. So check that out. Let's dive in. Today we're going to be building something from KBD Fans. It is the D65 keyboard, and we're going to be using GMK Moto 2 keycaps. So let's go ahead and unbox everything, see what we're working with here, and then we're gonna go ahead and build the board. Let's take a look at some of the accessories and the components of the keyboard that come with this. Up first we have here, the PCB. So this is the KBD67 Mark II RGB V3 PCB. And this is the PCB that goes with the D65 keyboard. Pretty standard PCB from KBD fans here. It's got south facing RGB per key, hot swap, all of the usual stuff that you expect to see. In here, I believe this is yeah, this is the plate that we're going to be using. So this is a commission build board. I'm building this for somebody who does a lot of daily typing, but also does a lot of gaming on this as well. And so we'll, we'll get back to the, the switches, but the plate that they have decided to go with is a brass plate. Very nice looking. And then in here is just a little box of accessories that come with the board and just some other components I tucked in here that we're gonna be using today as well. We have a USB-C cable, just a standard USB-C cable that comes with the keyboard. We have some hardware and a tool to screw in that hardware. So this is hardware that comes with the D65. We have KBD fans screw in stabilizers. However, we are not going to be using these today on the board. We are going to be using, ooh, so pretty, some um, Duroc V2 stabilizers. So these will not be going in here and we will be using the Duroc V2 stabilizers. These are the gaskets. So the D65 board is a gasket mount keyboard. So here are the gaskets and these look pretty thick and nice here. So I'm excited to see and feel how this board sounds. Hear how this board sounds. We have some desk keys, switch films. So all of the switches I'll be lubing with Crytox 205 grade zero. I'll be filming them all. The switches that we're going to be using are the Cherry Speed Silver switches. So like I said, this client uses this keyboard or plans on using this keyboard for a lot of gaming as well. And so um, they wanted a really short stroke and, and fast switch. So we went with the Cherry Speed Silvers. So we will be lubing and filming these. I've already lubed and filmed almost all of them except for this one pack here, which I'll do on camera to see the process. Um, but so those are the switches we'll be using. And then the last components in here is some fill, um, some foam. So we have um, some PCB and plate foam. So this piece will go in between the PCB and the plate, like I said. And then we have some case foam as well. So this piece will go underneath the PCB in the actual case. So there we go. There's all of the components we'll be using today. I'll stick all that in there and move that to the side. Uh, like I said, we'll be building this board with the GMK Moto 2, so the Mo modern Dolce 2 keycap set. So let's go ahead and just take a look at this. Oh. Really nice keycap set. Um, it's the light gray, the dark gray, 
As you can see in here, I have kind of the uh, reddish maroon color. This uh, is the standard Moto 2 set, so it also comes with some teal accents as well. Um, this is actually in, in stock at the time of this video from Omni Keys or Omni Type, I forget what the website is. But so this is an in stock GMK set. Um, so if you wanted to pick that up, you can check that out. So that is the keycap set we will be using for this build. That's the quickest I've ever put a GMK kit back into the outer box. And then finally, what we're all here for, the keyboard. Oh, I also have some of these um, films that go under stabilizers. I don't really know if these actually do anything or not. I have a few left over though, so I'm going to put them under um, the space bar, at least on this keyboard. All right, now for the main attraction. So again, this is KBD Fans D65 keyboard. It comes in this really nice box. It's a gray box and it's a magnetic closed top here. So we'll go ahead and open that up. Piece of foam, other piece of foam, and then we have the actual keyboard. And you can see this is actually a really nice box. There's a ton of padding in here. Um, I'll definitely just use this box to ship this keyboard to the client when I'm done building it. And now for the main attraction, the actual keyboard. So here we have the D65 keyboard. It's got that really nice brass weight on the bottom says D65 KBD fans and you can see here pretty standard uh, case layout there's a lot of weight to it it's a pretty hefty sturdy really premium feeling keyboard here like I said it is a gasket mount keyboard so we'll be taking off the top and the bottom um, and fitting everything in, inside so yeah there we have it So let's go ahead and build the keyboard. Hope you guys enjoyed today's unboxing video. I know I always love a good unboxing. Hope you're excited for the build video to come, the part two of the D65 keyboard, which will be releasing in a week. But now for the details that you all, I'm sure just fast forwarded to get to the giveaway. So. I will be giving away a set of Duroc V2 stabilizers to one lucky winner. Now I know Duroc stabilizers, it's not a crazy giveaway, but bear with me here. I'm starting small. Hopefully as the channel grows, I can do more of these giveaways and we can do some bigger and better giveaways and prizes. So stick with me. Now to enter into this giveaway to win the Duroc V2s, you must subscribe like and comment on this video and you need to comment LRK down below. So subscribe, like and comment LRK on this video. Part two video will be released in one week from today. So you have one week to do those three activities. You might as well just do them right now while you're listening to me. Subscribe, like and comment. And I will announce the winner on next week's video. So next week, the D65 build video. Within that, I will announce the winner of the Duroc V2 giveaway. Thank you all again for taking the time to watch this. I hope you're excited about the giveaway. I hope you're excited to see how the D65 turned out. And until next time, happy typing.